Right, hi, my name's Rollo and I'm here with Anne Kiofodong. Fong. Have I got your name right? Well, that's fine, absolutely fine. No, 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 it's not. Tell me exactly how your name sounds. Kiothabong. Right, that's who I'm here with, Anne. Kiothabong. Thank you very much, because I don't want to get it wrong again. <laughs> right? And we're here today, uh, I'm here to talk to Anne um, a little bit, find out a bit about her, and uh, she's a sporting person. What sport is it you play? I'm a tennis player. Tennis player. How long have you been playing tennis? I've been playing tennis professionally for over 10 years now. Over 10 years? Yeah. What made you get into tennis? And my dad was a big tennis fan, and it was something to do, keep me occupied after school, and um, you know, I was entered into tournaments straight away as soon as I could play. Clearly I decided to take it more seriously and, um, you know, turn pro and do everything properly, um, competing at all the top tournaments at the age of 18. I'm 26 years old now. 26? Yes, I am. Okay. You don't look 26. Younger? You look very good. You look very young, yeah, Thank for you. 26. <laughs> very, very young. Good eye cream, obviously. Definitely. <laughs> so uh, was there any other sport that, you know, like, I mean, your dad got you into tennis, but there was was there any other sport that, whilst you was doing tennis, that you was interested in thinking, Dad, I don't want to do this no more. I want to do maybe boxing. Taekwondo, close. I was close. Look yeah, at that. Close. I'm reading your mind. <laughs> Taekwondo. Yeah, I did a lot of that when I was younger and all the other sports at school, you know, athletics, netball, hockey. Um, I was quite sporty right from a young age. Okay, so sport is your thing, it basically. Is, How yeah. important do you think the youth games are to the youth uh, of today? Uh, I think it's incredibly important. You know, it gets kids out there um, leading an active, healthy lifestyle. Um, it gets them involved in team sports. You know, they, they support each other, get behind each other in those events, and it's really good fun. Fantastic. Have you uh, have you been involved in youth games when you was growing up? Did you ever yeah. do anything? I competed. I represented Hackney in tennis for the London. Oh, you're London. from East London? Yes, I am. Hang on one sec. We've we got to do this. East London's in the house. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> so you represented Hackney? Yeah. Um, in tennis and I won the tennis event and I think I must have been about 12 years old. So that was a long time ago. Okay. Yeah, but I've followed it since and, you know, whenever I see the Hackney kids out there competing, I'm all, like, there supporting them, really proud of them whenever they do well. Fantastic. Well, I'm from South London and um, I hosted the youth games a couple of years ago, so I was really rooting for South London, but there's no South East uh, war oh. game on here, nothing like that, <laughs> do you know what I mean? So the London youth games are happening when, and On the 3rd and 4th of July at Crystal Palace. Fantastic. Make sure you're there, you know. Absolutely. All right. <laughs>